why is my head cut off? Is this good enough? Can you see me? Is my head still cut off? Oh. Is this lighting better? I feel like it's cut off. Hey, so I decided to start this whole vlogging thing again. I know I haven't posted a vlog in like almost a year, maybe not even a year, but it's been a while. I never went anywhere with it, um, but it's been on my mind a lot lately and I think it's something I want to try. I want to try again. I'm going to be posting, I'm going to try to post vlogs every week depending on how exciting my life is or if there's anything going on. Which I'm sure there will be, there will be. I got a few concerts coming up, uh, like um, actually this weekend I'm going to go see Hey Violet. I'm so excited, so excited. I saw them in uh, LA actually with, with Five Sauce and Roy English, but I wasn't really into them at the time. Um, but. I just started listening to them like a couple months ago and I'm like, why haven't I done this sooner? I love them, I love them. Um, so I'm excited for that. Um, and then the day after that, I'm actually going to see Green Day. I know, um, I've been a big, 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 big Green Day fan all my life. Um, they really kind of shaped me to who I am right now. Um, they really helped me get by when I was a teenager. Um, yeah, I don't know, whenever I hear their music or anything, they just kind of feel like home, you know. I think everybody has that band or that certain music that they go to. Um, yeah, so I got that too. Um, who else? Oh, I have, I'm going to go see The Weeknd in New York uh, with my sister. That's um, in June, so that's a couple months away. But yeah, I'm ex so excited for that. Yeah, and then there'll be like... There'll be things that I'm doing in between that, like, um, I might show, like, some things I'm doing for work, um, I'll probably do, like, tutori t t tutorials? Tutorials? Am I saying that right? Tutorials. I don't know why I can't say that right now. Tutorials. Tut there you go. Tutorials. I got it. I got it. I'm smart. Funny kind of challenge videos, um, who knows. Uh, also, I'm going to be doing something that I've really wanted to share for a long time, um, but I'm going to keep it a surprise, and it's it's kind of a talent of mine, um, I'd like to say. Sorry, my phone just buzzed. Anyway, it's kind of a talent of mine. Um, people that who know me that are watching this probably already know, um, but yeah, I'm going to try and post some of those um, every week too. What else? Yeah, I might introduce you to uh, a few people in my life. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Um, yeah, so sorry I haven't been on this channel a lot, even though I have like seven followers right now. Sorry, seven subscribers right now. Thank you to my seven subscribers. Um, who knows, maybe one day I'll see 70 or 700. Or 7,000, I don't know. Dream big, dream big. So yesterday I did a little bit of shopping and I kind of want to share with you guys what I got. So at the end of this video there'll be a mini shopping haul, so stay tuned for that. Um, I know this video is a bit mixed up, but uh, I promise my other ones will not be like that. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try, try, try. I just want to show you like how much snow is actually out here why are you not focusing like look at all this snow you can see it like blowing So much snow. 
Alright, let's see if this winter got any better. The snow. Oh my god. Yep. Still snowy. Like, look at this chunk. This big, big ass chunk. It's kind of pretty. I actually don't mind it because that means I have a snow day and I get to stay in and work on some stuff I got around here. So I'm eating this homemade bacon, egg, and cheese. I was about to say McMuffin, but it's not from McDonald's, which can I say McDonald's has breakfast all day now and that is amazing. That is amazing. What do you guys get from McDonald's? I like to get the bacon and egg bagel. Mm, so good. Anyway, yeah, it's good stuff. Good stuff. And I'm also watching these dorks. Good mythical morning. They're doing like bathroom stuff edition. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if that's a good thing to watch while you're eating, but I'm good. I don't got a weak stomach. Hey, so I'm going to show you guys uh, what I got now. I went shopping yesterday. It's not that I needed these things. I just... I wanted them. I wanted them, so I got them. <laughs> Alright, what should I start off with? So I went to Yankee Candle yesterday because well, I just need some damn candles. I don't have any. I noticed I have a ton of incense. But, like, no candles, so I was like, damn, I need some candles. Alright, so this one, I don't know if you can see it okay, uh, it might be blurry, but it's, um, it's called Tahitian Nights. This was actually from their summer collection, which um, they had a sneak peek of this one and three others. So if you bought um, another candle at an original price, you get this one for like half off. So I was like, hell yeah, I love summer scents. Um, yeah, this one, um, it smells like if you were to go to like a tropical vacation and like, like this is what your hotel would smell like, your private beach home or something. Oh my God, it smells, it smells really good. Um, yeah, so that one. It's Tahiti and Nights. Alright, so the second candle I got um, is called Golden Sands. I'm not sure if you can see this, but yeah. Um, it has like, mm, it's like a sweet scent, but not too sweet. It's just, it's really, it's really nice. I tend, I tend to go for the sweet scents, but like this one isn't overpowering. It's a really nice scent. It smells like like a f like almost like a fruity drink. I don't know, but I love it. It's really nice. It's really nice. And then the last thing I bought from Yankee Candle is just um, just a few tea lights. Uh, it's a scent called Soft Blanket. Um, that teddy bear just adorable. So as you can imagine, this one smells like a warm blanket just straight out of the dryer. It's got that like fresh linen smell. Oh, it's so nice. It's so nice. I cannot wait to try these. Alright, so the next thing I bought um, is this 5 Seconds of Summer calendar. See it? I'm probably going to give it to my little sister because um, she actually really wanted this one, but she got a different one for Christmas. Um, so I, I never ended up getting one for her. Um, but the thing is, is that HMV is going out of business, so they had like this huge ass sale um, on everything in their store, and they had like only a couple of these left, and it just didn't feel right walking out without it. So I, I got this for like a great price. Yeah, don't get me wrong, I am a huge Five Seconds of Summer fan. Huge Five Sauce fan. It's just I don't really use calendars anymore. I've been using like agendas for like a few years now. Um, and I just find they're more handy, um, and just mobile, you know, you can take it anywhere. Um, my sister really likes Five Sauce, so, and she uses calendar, so she can have two now. Whatever. When I, I told her I got it, and she was really excited, so. I'm a big fan. Mikey girl. Um, 
I love all of them. They're all special in their own way, but there's just something about Michael that just gets me. I don't know. There's just something about him. I'm from Canada, but I actually went to Los Angeles to see Five Sauce. Like, I don't know. I'm crazy. But, well, I didn't go there. I didn't go there just to see them. I actually planned, like, a whole, a whole vacation to go there. But I saw that they were actually playing on one of the days that I was staying there. So I'm like, hell yeah, I might as well go see them. So I, so I figured, why not go see them while I'm there? And I did. And I got pit tickets, and I was on Michael's side. And it was just definitely the closest I've been to, like, a big, huge band. And oh, it was amazing. I have tons of videos and pictures. Um, maybe that can be a story for another time. I would love, love, love to share it. I actually met Roy English. Um, I have a picture posted on my Twitter. Um, I'll leave a link in the below all my social medias, Twitter, Instagram, all that jazz. Um, yeah, I'd love to share that story with you guys. Um, yeah, so that's another thing I bought. Oh my god, all I can smell are these candles. Oh my god, I'm in love. I might light one after this video. All right. So the next thing I bought is I actually bought a new camera, but you can't see it because I'm clearly using it. But um, yeah, so this is the box. Um, it's a Sony. You know, I don't need anything huge. Um, anyway, oh shit, nothing too big. I'm going to be using this for most of my vlogging. Um, I'll also be using my phone. I'll be using some of my webcam. Oh my god. Blink1998 on Instagram. Uh, they're a 5 sauce update account. They just posted a photo that um, somebody posted of 5 sauce at the forum. That was my show. I don't know if you can see this, but that was my show. Memories. That's so weird. I was just talking about that. And then the last thing I got is just a purse, Forever 21. Um, I like the simple, uh, you know, solid, minimal colors, so just black and gold is a good one. Um, it comes with like the little straps or the big straps. You can uh, hook onto it. See, I like big purses when I'm like especially going to work so I can carry like my water bottle and since it's winter now, like my scarves, my hats my gloves, everything. Um, I do have this huge pink bag, but, um, also from Forever 21. Um, but it doesn't zip up, and, like, that's kind of been bugging me lately, and this one does, so, and it will fit everything perfectly. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's my mini shopping haul, um, and that's it for this video. So, if you liked, you know, give a like, if you know you didn't like i guess give the thumbs down but hopefully you liked it um and if you want to see more of my life and all the stuff i'm going to be doing um su subscribe to my channel um yeah so that's it for now thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye